Hello everyone, welcome to Learn Reality Consult, ladies and gentlemen. Today, I'm going to practically demonstrate how to use comparison tools on the ArcGIS desktop with respect to raster data. So at the end of this lesson, you should be able to know how to use the Flickr tool, the Swipe tool, and pixel inspector as well as how to customize tools on ArcGIS desktop so let's get started so before you start this tutorial you need to have data i'm going to use my previous data that i used in my last video which is the aspect uh, raster and the digital elevation model of Quavo in Ghana so with this let me first of all demonstrate how to use the swap tool you can access the swap tool through windows and come to image analysis and the image analysis a dialogue will be open like image analysis with the various images on the table of context it will be displayed here and then you can, these are contrasts, you can increase and so on. And we have, this is the zoom to raster resolution. And then we have the swap tool and the flicker tool. So let's first of all, let's demonstrate how to use the swap tool. So click on the image aspect tip and then click on this. And then click on the map and you drag it. With this, you can make comparison of the original gray raster data of the Quahu as against the aspect. You see, you can make visual impression. This tool is very relevant when you want to simultaneously compare two images at the same time. So it is important to know how to use this tool. So other sizes, you can drag from other sizes or anywhere. Let's below to you can do it. So that's basically how to use the swap tool. The second most important tool that I will demonstrate it is the how to use the flicker tool. With respect to the flicker tool, it turn on and off of the two images for you to have visual impression so when you put the time period here maybe 500 with respect to that period of time it turns and on and off of the two images so with this it has similar function just like the swipe tool you can make inferences and impressions from the two images so it's also very relevant and quick for having a, a first insight into two images. You can make case, you can look casually at those two images and can, you can make some impressions with respect to the two images. So that is you can turn off from here. So now as you zoom in your data or your image sometimes it is very difficult to know the length and the height of a, a pixel of the image so with this you can use the uh, uh, pixel inspector uh, to know it gives you the boundaries of the various pixels so with this first of all let's customize our pixel inspector you can go to customize come to customize mode, mode come to commands and type on pixel and this one apply to any tool that you want to really customize and with this you can just highlight it and drag and drop and this is it that's the pixel inspector it is on this 
and you can close it so with this when you zoom in you can click on it and then let's collapse this table of contents and this is it let's open and this is it so as you click on it it gives you the boundaries of the various um pixels you see gives you the boundaries of the various pixels gives you the boundaries of the various pixels give boundaries of the various pixels zoom out you see And that is basically how to use the Pixel Inspector. In this video, I clearly demonstrated how to use the Swipe tool, the Flickr tool, the uh, Pixel Inspector, as well as how to customize tools. Kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel for more entertaining videos. Thank you very much.